Hey, Phil from Got Memories here. I've got something really cool that I've never seen before, and that's Rex. I've seen a lot of stuff. Anyway, I'm gonna be wearing you around my neck here, um, and what I have never, what I have seen before, and what I haven't seen before, I've seen lots of these. Okay, Super 8 Technicolor Magic cartridges. These are Super 8 film, but instead of being on a reel like this, which is what 99.9999% of film is on these reels. And then if you've got larger ones, um, someone in your family spliced them together so they've got longer running time. Now these here acted kind of like an early day VHS, you know, VCR type thing. So what I have to do with these when I digitize them, I gotta break them open and put them on small reels like this so I can run them on the tow bins and everything. But what this customer, um, who this belongs to here. She's like, hey, I've got the original projector and and it works and do you want it? And I was like, sure. So here we go. Look at this thing. Um, my God, this thing weighs a ton. Oh my God. Could do some curls with that. All right. Wow, that's hurt my wrist. <laughs> um, wow, look at this thing. It's a bit dusty and everything, but um, elevation, hmm, so, we've got to plug that, it's a bit bent, but look, it's like a, it's like a vacuum cleaner, no way, <laughs> woo, all right, so let's bend these, and let's turn this on, and see if it works, the thing is with all these old projectors, is the bulbs, so if the bulb doesn't go, my goodness, good luck, trying to get hold of one. Let's plug it in here, Let's see. And do a little drum roll. I have not tested this. It smells very old. Um, <laughs> so yeah, look, Su Technicolor, it all lines up with the branding of, of this. So let's see, on, off, hold on, stand by. No. Oh God, that doesn't sound good. Elevation, oh okay, elevation would be this. There we go. <laughs> I thought maybe you gotta adjust it if you're in Denver. Um, so let's put this in, hold on, I'm gonna turn the lights out. Let's see if we can get a, oh God. It's not exactly the brightest thing in the world, but um, let's see. Have a look here. What am I doing? Okay, that needs to go in there. Oopsie. Okay, there we go. So I'm kind of. All right. Okay, well, I guess. Oh, it's going. No way. Frame. I can see a little bit of movement, but it's out of focus. Where's their focus? Hmm. Anyway, you can kind of see it. It's see, that's very cool. All right, let's do this. Let's, elevation. I'm gonna turn it off a second. Okay, the focus is fixed. Hmm, oh, here we go, look. It goes in and out. That's what she said. All right, um, so, hmm, still doesn't really help. What is going on here? See, look, uh, there's nothing under here, nothing over there. This is very cool though, oh my God. <laughs> um, but yeah, you can see it's like going, hmm. Anyway, in the comments, um, let me know if uh, anyone knows how to focus this thing. But the bulb is still, see this is fixed. Zoom, Technicolor, yes, yeah, the zoom, so there's no, maybe it's just dirty and it needs a good clean. Anyway, I'll keep you posted on, uh, on that. Um, this little uh, gem, it's got a little handle. 
Very cool. There we go. Boom. This is a very rare find. I would say rare in the case that it is, yeah, that lens is super dirty. I mean, this is many years of grime. Hmm. I'm going to have to do a little unboxing, but that is super cool. Uh, let's see here. If this goes, way Excellent. Well, anyway, if you do have these uh, magic cartridges, I do have vi other videos on these on how I open them. I take this little pin out. And you've got to then open it. You cut it, and you've got to very carefully splice them onto reels. Um, this can go to hell in a handbasket very quickly if you're not paying attention. Um, it's like a bird's nest on the floor. Anyway, um, if you've got this stuff and you want me to digitize it, uh, gotmemories.com, there's a lot more reviews there now, but, um, or you can just info at gotmemories or text over what you have and, uh, you can go from there. All right. Cheers.